Hi, I'm Derek Howes, The Protein Chef, and Ninja reached out to me to introduce you to the Ninja Nutri-Blender, the latest in Ninja's family of five-star blenders. You can use the Ninja Nutri-Blender to make your favorite blended drinks, smoothies, frozen cocktails, milkshakes, and so much more. The Nutri Ninja Blender comes with a 700 watt motor base, which is extremely compact and fits easily on my countertop. And 700 watts is powerful, powerful enough to crush frozen fruit, ice, and other tough ingredients like leafy greens, broccoli, and Brussels sprouts. Ninja's push to blend technology and the Pro Extractor Blades will quickly break down whole fruits and veggies to create nutrient extractions, crushing ingredients and ice. This is a kitchen essential for anyone interested in a healthy diet or for anyone who is simply looking for a convenient and easy way to make delicious smoothies or frozen drinks. The Nutri Ninja Blender also comes with single serve to go cups with spout lids. The great part, you can blend your drinks directly in these cups. Once your drink is blended, remove it from the motor base, screw off the blade assembly and pop on a spout lid for easy on the go sipping. These cups fit easily in your card's cup holder for a quick grab while you're running errands. Looking for healthy and delicious recipes? Check out the inspiration guide that comes with every Nutri Ninja blender. I found some great ideas I can start with, like the Coconut Mango Energy Aid or the Lean Green Ninja. This guide also provides helpful tips, such as how to best load your Ninja Nutri Blender with ingredients so you can achieve the best results. Now let's see what this thing can do. Today, I'm going to show you how to make the sweet and spicy spinach recipe, which you can find directly in your inspiration guide. Start by adding the fresh fruits and vegetables. First, add in one cord green apple cut into quarters. Then, add a half of a peeled lemon with the seeds removed and a half inch piece of fresh ginger. Then, add in half a cup of baby spinach. Lots of nutrients coming from that spinach. Then, pour in your liquid. For this recipe, we're going to add a half a cup of apple juice and a third a cup of water. For thinner results or a juice-like consistency, you can add additional liquid. Just ensure that you do not fill above the max liquid line written on the cup. Then add in your sticky or dry ingredients like powders or nut butters toward the end of the loading. For this recipe, I'm adding in one tablespoon of agave nectar, but you can use honey if you prefer. Lastly, top with ice. Next, twist on the bladed lid, being super careful not to touch the edges because these things are sharp. Flip the cup upside down and place it on the base. Then push down on the cup to pulse or blend. Continue to press down till you get to the consistency that you prefer. Once you're done blending, lift the cup to remove. Turn the cup over so the blade assembly is on top, then twist the blade assembly counterclockwise to remove. To take your blended contents on the go, place the spout lid on the cup and turn it clockwise to seal. Do not store any of your blended drinks with the blades attached. Looking for more recipe inspiration, tips and tricks? Visit us at ninjakitchen.com.